Welcome everybody to the third Riot Summit. Uh, my name is Matthias Wierisch, I'm one of the coordinators of this event. Um, the Riot Summit, for those of you who do not know, is a yearly get together of the Riot community. So if you're a newbie, it's a perfect opportunity to get in contact to a mind riot, and if you're an oldie, it's a perfect opportunity to connect with your uh, fellow writers. Um, before we start with a brief recap of the keynote, um, I just want to give you a brief overview um, about what you can expect. Um, the riots have a bit in two days. Um, this day is a single track session. We have uh, multiple talks um, about uh, IoT topics that relate to riot, um, but also about uh, upcoming new trends. We have two breaks, um, a coffee break, uh, one after the keynote, and then another one in the afternoon session. And we will have lunch in between. Um, tomorrow is a bit uh, differently structured. Um, this is more focused on hands on stuff. Um, we have uh, two tutorials in the morning. One is a beginner tutorial uh, where we are introduced to the right um, from a technical point of view, and we have a maintainer tutorial. And uh, later we have uh, several breakout sessions. And um, these breakout sessions um, also are structured based on your input. So if you want, to discuss a specific topic, um, feel free uh, to come to us and um, we will then um, support the program accordingly. Um, today, you can expect um, talks about IT networking applications, and uh, in the afternoon, we have a special focus on security. Um, we will also have demos. Um, demos will be presented uh, today during the breaks, and this is on the right hand side. There's a room opposite of the room where we uh, have lunch. Um, so feel free to uh, buy. And um, for those of you who have a demo um, and need 15.4, um, please coordinate with your um, uh, other demo presenters as it is no overlap. Um, later this day, we will have a social, kindly sponsored by the Vibe NCC, who also helped us very much in organizing this event in Amsterdam. That's the first time that we meet here in Amsterdam. Um, this, the social is um, uh, three minutes away from here. Um, we will have a, a joint one for those of you who want to get uh, together. And we will leave here. Um, you have to go to Central Station and then uh, take a ferry. The trip is uh, one minute away um, from the island. And then um, there's a little walk. And uh, yeah, that is uh, good For those of you who uh, entered uh, this venue here via car, um, you can uh, you can get a special ticket that uh, allows you to uh, have a discount code um, that is only three euros instead of being four or six euros. So just come to me and I will organize it. Uh, finally, um, if you do photos and uh, are uh, social media addicted, then please share your input. Um, there's a right summit hashtag and last but not least, thank you all uh, for coming. Special thanks to the speakers who are willing to share the insight with us, and even more special thing uh, to the sponsors, because uh, without the sponsors, we will not be able to organize this without any fees by you. So special thank you to Zilke, ST Microelectronics, uh, Cisco, Server Linux, Swipe, NCC, Wolfgang, and, and SIDN. So, thank you all. I hope you have a very nice time here. <laughs> Okay, hello. Um, just before uh, we start, I'm going to do a small recap of uh, last year. Um, just kind of, uh, traditional small just before the uh, study starts. So, our self uh, um, assigned mission is to uh, program and connect low end IoT. So, by that, we mean all types of devices that are now connected to the network or that will be connected to the network that are much, much more uh, lightweight than something like Raspberry Pi, right? So which is about like knowing what instead of what, uh, et cetera, et cetera. Uh, so what is Riot in this context? Uh, it's mainly three things. Um, it's an operating system for these devices where you know, we'll never uh, be able to run Linux uh, sadly. Uh, it's a free uh, open source software platform. 
uh, and it's a Latvian community of developers, uh, which uh, have the, the following principles of uh, having uh, open source score. Uh, the fact that it's free and it's, it's going to uh, we do all our uh, uh, efforts so that the, the, the core remains free, uh, and uh, we. Uh, um, I believe in grassroots governance. Uh, there's a, a paper that you want to maybe to uh, um, get to read, uh, which just appeared in the uh, uh, Internet of Things journal. Um, and it described all this in details. Uh, so the last year, um, since the uh, summit uh, 17, we have now 200 uh, contributors worldwide. Um, we have more than 130 boards supported with new architectures like RISP and ESP8266 very recently. Um, we have uh, seen 4,000 comments, actually more than that, and four releases with many new exciting features, uh, such as the field of stack, uh, some new interpreters, um, uh, a lot of new uh, crypto components. And uh, last but not least, uh, highlighted here is all the work we've done on the CI, uh, where we have uh, 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 um, aspects that are not covered with the beginning of hardware the loops that's doing some Nike builds uh, and a lot of recommended tests. So um, in parallel, uh, just zooming out, like what happened over the last year in the IoT, um, well, uh, the hype is decreasing maybe, uh, which is uh, making good, uh, but the IoT remains what it really is, which is similar to the internet itself, it's a general technology, so it's, its impact is, is not completely, um, um, uh, the hype was not completely uh, unfounded. Uh, in terms of cybersecurity uh, and vulnerabilities that are uh, due to MT, well, the concerns continue to widen and to deepen, uh, so this is definitely a, a topic. In terms of uh, Hardware that appears, uh, it continues to diversify and to evolve pretty quickly uh, with new reviews, new boards, uh, new uh, architectures. Um, and in terms of software, which is what we care about, uh, there's a very, very high activity, um, uh, not only in Rive, but also in uh, uh, other OSs such as Zephyr and uh, FreeRTOS, which are supported by Intel and Amazon. So basically, the interest uh, and activity in the commercial activity in this uh, context is, is high. Um, so with this context, um, I just wanted to give uh, some food for thought for like maybe the open mic. Uh, what's next for Riot? Uh, we need to think about it and we would like to hear from you. Um, so if you have some, uh, some ideas of what we should put on our roadmap, please uh, speak up at some point uh, during your talk or uh, at uh, the open mic here on today. Um, so uh, security is uh, definitely an uh, important aspect, so we want to continue to beef up security. Um, there's some uh, public uh, I mentioned here, uh, software updates where we're, we're making some progress, but there's still some work to do. Um, uh, we want to continue to enhance the CI and continue our work on uh, uh, deploy further hardware in the text, uh, hardware in the loop uh, testing. Um, and of course, extend our support to upcoming uh, uh, hardware, up and coming hardware. So, uh, I'm stating a few here. There's tons of tasks to do, but um, we would like to hear from you. So um, please uh, speak up at the open mic um, and um, we'll, uh, we'll try to shape our, our roadmap accordingly. So that's it um, for the small recap. Um, enjoy your summit. And now, I promise you.